Good afternoon, YouTube. Here for another quick update on the Chippewas. Oop. What happens when you have kids around the house? They put batteries in your boots and other toys. These are a Chippewa mock toe, kind of an unnamed, an un named brand but if you look at that anybody can give me any updates on what they think the date on that there is no date i guess if you can go and there are some people maybe look at those numbers there 11 e i don't know if you can see that 11 e what is that 82 82 uh 823 maybe that's the model 11 e 823 uh, definitely older than I am. I would put these in the 60s at the youngest. Maybe in the 50s. The soles that came out here, came off of them. Really, really old. The old Montagna. I put them with the, uh, the 100 lugs. And I sent them out to Chad Leather Sniffers on Instagram. I'll post all of his info down there. You can contact him. And he put a new midsole on there. He said he kept the original, uh, the welt. He said that was really good. And he kept the midsoles. That's the one thing that I wish I would have kind of pressed him on a little bit, is to redo uh, the mids, uh, the, the the insoles. They're just standard leather insoles. They are kind of uh, uh, uncomfortable. But I might just put a, 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 an insole in there. But I've used them a handful of times. Uh, they are, as you can see, they have the the screws in there. They've been glued and stitched. So let's take a little bit closer look and clean them up a bit. Like I was saying, Chippewa, kind of an un, unnamed boot other than the mock toe. Uh, just with a little bit of a microfiber and some water. You just wipe off the dust. Nothing fancy here. My other videos, I'll scrub them down when they get really muddy and dirty. And with that, people get really hurt thinking that I'm doing it wrong. I'm ruining my boots because I'm putting a dish soap, a hand soap on there. I'm going to strip it out for some reason, but I have had nothing but good experiences. Even with it a little bit damp from the water, you just hit this up. It'll kind of put a little a shine on that. Nothing big. I always like the the natural look that they you can leave on there. Of course they can dye that black, but I like that midsole, how that's colors. And I mean this just really shows its age. The leather is held up really well for how old it's imagined to be. And it's just a just really cool, I guess you can call it Americana boot. Mock toe by Chippewa. Chippewa Shoes, Chippewa Shoe Company, Chippewa Falls, Wisconsin. Uh, registered U.S. Patent Office, but no patent number. Resold with a Vibram. Go hiking with them, go working with them. There they are, my Chippewa boots. If you have any questions, like and subscribe leave the comments below thank you for watching my videos have a wonderful afternoon adios